Mr. Mayor, you're big on saying that we all have to follow the rules. And I'm going to go back to Resolution 1461. I'm going to read the paragraph. And, Council, I'm, I'm suggesting that this is pretty simple. Here's what it says. Time limits. Persons desiring to speak on an agenda item will be recognized to speak when the agenda item is reached. It doesn't say maybe should if the mayor says so. <coughs> Citizens, according to Resolution 1461, have a right to speak at when the agenda item is reached. You did not do that tonight. I know that the city council lost a First Amendment lawsuit while you and you guys paid it out while you presided as mayor. I, I, and you also promised in that decision, did you not, that you would do all you could to respect the First Amendment. Tonight you have violated Resolution 1461. Tonight you have prevented a citizen from petitioning her government for a redress of grievances. That's a violation of the First Amendment, Mr. Mayor. And I have already submitted this for the record. It's easy to read. And the rest of you, he doesn't outrank you. You know that this is being violated. It doesn't take a master's degree in English, as I have, to understand the simple language. And for the rest of you to allow him to do this makes you tacitly responsible for it as well. Also, it's particularly odious to listen to you tell us where we can park and how many parking spots we need when, Mr. Mayor, this is your diner yet again. I'd like to submit it for the record. You say it is uh, you say it's against the law to do business in the right of way. Yet you continue to park have people park in front of your diner with vehicles extending into the road. You said that that was dangerous. And I know that you would be concerned about this, Mr. Solis. That blocks the way of emergency vehicles. You yourself said it's unsafe. You say you're living under 1986 laws and your grandfathered in. That does not apply to parking in the road. That's a violation of state law. Mr. Mayor, if you're going to continue to tell us how we can park and where we can park. You need to set the example and follow the law. You're violating the law, sir. And the rest of you know this. It's the talk of the town. We have a mayor that tells people how to park, and yet he is the worst violator. You said, Mr. Mayor, the most important thing you can do is to make everybody look better. Let's start with your diner, because your diner parking spaces are janky. And it is particularly odorous to have a government with a mayor as the worst violator continuing to pass laws. The rest of you know what I'm saying is true. And I'd ask you to hold each other accountable.